Good morning from day six in Paris. Uh, I'm running late as usual, walking to the college. I've worn my outfit, looking pretty in pink. Uh, plan for today is that we are going to a Chanel event. Uh, that is going to be crazy. Hopefully, I don't know. Uh, expecting a lot out of it, obviously. That's their Pele College, then Chanel event. And then we don't know what we're doing because we don't know when we will be free. So, yep, we'll figure out that later. But tomorrow, uh, 14th July is a national holiday here in France. I don't know why. I'll uh, ask about that and let you guys know also educate myself. Uh, but tonight, there are going to be some amazing fireworks show at Eiffel Tower. So we're going to be witnessing that. I'm out of breath because you have to walk a lot. But that is good morning from day six. Here for lunch again at Cafe Audelon. Let me pull some water. Fiona is back in her natural curls, looking so pretty. I think red is your color, Fiona. You look the prettiest. I clicked some candid pictures of her today morning, and they are the best pictures of this trip. <laughs> And look at the view, so gorgeous, obviously outside sitting with my Barushka bag. We've ordered the burrata pizza. And look at our gorgeous, beautiful looking food. So post lunch, I touched up my face a little with makeup. I got ready in the college itself, we took a bus and now we are here in a different area. We are here for a Chanel workshop that my college was very kind to arrange for us, few students. And I got in a chance, I'm damn excited. See, these are the opportunities, you know, you crave. Um, and this is what the benefits are of being an international student. Uh, yep. So this is the exposure we're all looking at. Uh, I mean, getting hands on with Chanel and their heritage products just uh, their production making all of it is just such a privilege for a fashion student um, i'm damn excited so that is the plan for today which is why i'm dressed so special with like a blazer and stuff uh, i hope it goes well i'll keep you guys updated of course i'm taking you guys so changed and came to Primark to shop. Uh, shopped a lot again, uh, got gifts and stuff. So that should be fine but I've been spending a lot. I should really calm down but I think this is my last shopping spot like random high street shopping. I want to go Sephora for sure but let's see that is when that happens. Came to Subway to pick my dinner. Got the primer, have a few in my bag also. Had a terrible experience at Primark. Like, I, this is my first time ever shopping at Primark, and um, 
even though they have good stuff and cheap prices but they don't keep you very well like you know if it's a cheap store they treat you like it's a cheap store um the women i shopped for more than 10000 indian rupees um and uh, the women there treated me like uh, i was taking all this for free just saw the eiffel tower twinkle for the first time now it's shut what oh my god main bol rahi hu ki but now it's shut look at this wait whatever this is it's gorgeous good morning guys it's 14th of july today is bastel day which is a national holiday in france so we didn't have college so we're out it's i think 4:15 pm and we're out right now uh last night we went to see eiffel in its glory shining glory it was so beautiful especially because it's festival day so they were having some rehearsals where eiffel was changing 100 colors it was gorgeous to get the opportunity to see something that happens so rarely uh we're now going to the ysl coffee shop i'm so damn excited about it the summers here in france have gone bad Our skin is burning. Oh, uh, but this is what it is. Also, I'm wearing a corset that just didn't fit right somehow uh, on my uh, chest. So I had to cover up with a scarf just for pictures. We can do corset, but yep, that is what is happening. This is the Saint Laurent coffee shop. There's addicted to Saint Okay, giving you a 360 tour. Look at everybody sitting on the streets. It's blocked. Look at the pretty, pretty Eiffel. And yeah, sitting on the street. That's my spot. Do you all know that Emirates broke my luggage? If you don't know, go check out the vlog. Link is in the description. But while traveling, Emirates broke my luggage, and they've sent a new one. The replacement. They've sent some other brand. Uh, but I guess it should be good. That's it for this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share, subscribe, share it with your friends and family. We really need it. I really need the support. I'm working really hard on the series, uploading every day, um, and capturing everything for you guys. So please show some love. And that's it. Thank you. Bye.